Ansich, how are you doing? Hi, thank you. I'm very good. Okay, so tell me something about your company, Threadsol. So Threadsol is a, a you know an IT company working in the garment tech sector. Uh, we're headquartered in Singapore with presence in more than 15 countries. And we work with the manufacturers and the brands all around the world to save their cost of manufacturing and make it more profitable. So let's talk about your flagship product, IntelliCut. So who are the end users of IntelliCut and what are the problems you're trying to solve for them? So IntelliCut is uh, used by the manufacturers for the apparel sector all around the world. Uh, for all these manufacturers who make the garments, fabric is their biggest cost. And what we do is we ensure with IntelliCut that on the floor they're able to cut the fabric with automated planning and optimizations, which ensures that they have least possible wastages and that saves them fabric cost. So that's what IntelliCut does and it solves their problem of fabric cost and its wastages on the floor. Okay, in this dynamic world, there are many technologies for apparel production available right now. How is your technology different from those? Look, there are lots of technologies available, I understand that part. For example, you have ERP, which is essentially a place where you keep all the data in and out for the whole enterprise. Then you have product lifecycle management products, which are basically for your trims and accessories and everything else. Then you have uh, products for efficiency and monitoring for scheduling. Uh, then you have products for your computer design CAD software for making markers. But they all have their space. Now, the space we occupy with IntelliCut is actually the space in which we are doing the day-to-day -day production run and the plans uh, for the factories for every order and ensure that this is optimized and we're able to save fabric for every order. And we work with all of these technologies to achieve that thing. So we have integrations with all of these. So we don't replace e any of them. We're not an alternate to any of them, but we are 100% complementary to these products to ensure that the manufacturers are able to save fabric and the cost. Okay, what are the significant paradigm shifts you have been able to provide to the user community? Uh, first and foremost, the point is that our technology is actually a cloud-enabled one. So we do not deploy anything on your computers, which means that you save cost for your hardware and your software maintenance. It's completely online. It's almost like Google and Facebook. Uh, that's a very, very big cost differentiator. It also ensures that whenever we innovate and create a new version of the product, you get it for free automatically. You don't have to purchase a new license or something like this. That's a very important step. Secondly, all the data capturing that happens on the floor for all our automated processes and stuff, they are actually happening over handheld devices, tablets, and phones. So which means that the whole process is lubricated, and we're also giving the results and the reports on the phones. So the people who are decision makers can see the results while they're on the go. So these are some very important innovations which we have carried through to help the manufacturers. What are the additional benefits in the software beyond its general use case? Well, look, uh, if, if whatever kind of fabric you know, or uh, you know, garment you're making, uh, it could be lingerie, it could be t-shirt, jackets, trousers, and wherever you're making, we can handle uh, all of these. Uh, we can handle all the variations in the fabric that comes along with defects and damages and shortages and excesses, width variations, shade variations, shrinkage variations. There are all variations on the floor which, for, which actually manufacturers have to contend with on a daily basis. We handle all of these uh, components automatically with our product and ensure that your results are always good and you're able to save fabric on a daily basis. So these are very important constituents, I believe. That's really great to hear. Let's talk about your second product, IntelliBuy. So Mansi, tell me, how does IntelliBuy work? Uh, so IntelliBuy actually works with the uh, manufacturers and helps their merchandisers at the buying stage. So. For every large manufacturer, there is a merchandising team which actually makes predictions about how much fabric to buy for every order that they're going to cut on the floor. And that's today mostly manual and it takes a lot of time and effort for them to do it. We do it completely with an automatic uh, product which integrates with the computer-aided design software as well. So uh, IntelliBuy is to make sure that your buying becomes more intelligent and more optimized and you save at the buying stage as well. How does your two products, IntelliCut and IntelliBuy, work in sync? 
There is, of course, like uh, uh, Intello by takes in a lot of feedback from Intello cut. So whenever we are executing orders on the floor level in the factories, uh, we would like to know how much wastage the floor is uh, you know, encountering. And that information has to go back to the top so that when I'm buying the fabric, I can factor that particular percentage as well. Also, there are other parameters like the variations that I'm going to see in the production floor. They also have to be factored in like weight shrinkage and everything I said. So, you know, these two products work together in conjunction with each other. They both feed off success and data of each other's. So that's how it works. On an average, what is the level of automation the two products provide? Uh, it's very important to ensure that the effort on both the places, at the buying stage and the cutting stage, is you know, reduced by a lot because you know, more and more the number of orders are becoming big and the order quantities are becoming small, so which means more pressure for both the teams for planning and execution. So what it means that is now that if you put an Intello buy at the buying stage, this becomes completely automated. You put Intello cut at the cutting stage, that becomes completely automated and then talk to each other. So it brings about a lot of automation, saves a lot of time and effort. Uh, our second version of our products which we will be launching would be purely on artificial intelligence which would mean that we can reduce greatly the number of uh, time and you know, effort and number of people who are involved in doing these jobs and make it more you know, automated processes oriented. That's the next step of our evolution, by the way. So yeah, it's, it's just a lot of things that we're doing there. That's really good. That sounds really promising. What would be the dream state of your product in the next two years? Look, our, our, we have had a very successful run uh, we, have, we are being used by over hundreds of manufacturers around the globe on a daily basis. Uh, the huge amount of division making flows through our software right now. We're planning more than $2 billion worth of production through our software right now, which is a lot of money. Uh, the next stage, of course, is to go to all the largest garment manufacturing countries, which are like around 30, 40 countries. We're already in 15 of them. Uh, so we're expanding rapidly. That will be the second, next stage of our product, uh, evolution of our business as well. And we also look forward to uh, improving our product into an artificial intelligence-based system, as I said, so that we can aid more people at a much more cheaper price. So that will be the future dream state that I would like to achieve in the next couple of years. Thank you, Michael. Always a pleasure. Thank you very much.